Okay, Lauren, thanks very much. Breaking overnight, there's been another ATM heist in our area, but this time police say they caught one of the suspects. It happened at a bank branch in Cockeysville overnight. That's a picture of the ATM ripped off the wall of the drive through at that bank. You can see in the background of that picture, that's an SUV that police say was used in the attempt to steal that ATM. The bank's on York Road across from the Super Walmart in Cockeysville near Warren Road. WMR2 News' Megan Knight is there at that scene right now. Megan, what are police saying about this most recent ATM heist attempt. Yeah, this is uh, the second one that we've seen in Baltimore County in less than a week now, Christian, and police say that they have arrested one person. They're still looking for others, though. They didn't specify exactly how many they're looking for. Now, this latest heist happening just after midnight uh, when police say that a group was trying to rip an ATM out of the outside wall of the West Banco Bank here off York Road in Cockeysville. The SUV they were using to try to pull that ATM out was still at the scene. Now, even though they did get the ATM out of the wall, police say that no money was stolen from it. And we don't know at this point if this is all connected to a series of other ATM thefts that we've been seeing happening around the area uh, recently. It was just last week there was a group of thieves who tried to steal an ATM from Security Square Mall. That was inside the mall where they smashed a car through the front doors early Thursday morning, drove right at the ATM, but they were unsuccessful at getting it out. There have been other successful attempts, however, at stealing ATMs in Baltimore City, including one heist in August at a 7-Eleven store off Falls Road in Hamden, and then one at another 7-Eleven. That was in Fells Point in mid-September, where the thieves made off with $5,000 in cash. Anyone with information about this latest burglary attempt can, of course, call Baltimore County Police. We're live in Cockeysville. I'm Megan Knight, WMAR 2 News.